Graphical Analysis is an iPad application available for purchase from the Apple App Store and is the preferred way for iPad users to interact with data from Vernier's sensors. Before you attempt to share your LabQuest 2 data with Graphical Analysis for iPad, you must make sure your LabQuest is connected to your preferred network and data sharing is on. You can verify this information by tapping the Wi-Fi icon in the lower right corner of the screen. This launches the Connections app. Note that my LabQuest is connected to the Veneer Guest Network and data sharing is on. You should also note the name of your LabQuest so you know which LabQuest you're looking to share with. My LabQuest is Group 1. Before you attempt to connect your iPad to a LabQuest 2, it can be helpful to already have collected some data. Now that we have the LabQuest 2 set up, let's work with the iPad. To share data with Graphical Analysis for iPad, you must connect your iPad to the same network your LabQuest 2 is connected to. This step is critical as you cannot share data if your iPad and LabQuest are on different networks. Launch the iPad Settings app. Verify your iPad's Wi-Fi is on and connected to the correct network, which for me is Vernier Guest. Note that it is not necessary for your network to have internet access when sharing data. Launch Graphical Analysis on your iPad. If this is the first time you are using Graphical Analysis, the app will be set to use the built-in accelerometers. Tap the Source button in the top left corner of the screen. This action displays a list of discovered data sharing sources. Tap the name of your LabQuest to establish a connection. Once a connection is established, the Source button will show the name of the connected LabQuest and any collected data will be transferred to and displayed on the iPad. The green circle next to the source name indicates the connection is live. You are now sharing data.